I'm biting my tongue because um, juggling a few things here. I'll just speak what I'm thinking. I'm, I'm juggling a few things here in um, protecting the sanctity of the relationship I have with David because he is a friend and uh, I want him to get better. Just, or, just or, take accountability and, uh, and understand, really understand the situation. Um, but also, I don't think it should fall to the wayside. And I, I, I do have opinions on this. I kind of voiced on Twitter a little bit what I was thinking because coming from someone who has been there and has been down and out, like, yeah, this it, tweet, this tweet kind of blew up. Yeah, so it was super, it was late at night and I, I I wrote this, I wrote, in 2017, I couldn't get out of my own way. I made mistake after mistake and was condemned, rightfully so, by the world. I remember how dark it felt back then. I embarrassed myself and my family, was blacklisted by every platform and brand. Close friends and peers turned their backs on me. It felt like the end of the road. Four years later, I've come to realize that these blunders, followed by my willingness and enthusiasm to truly change for the better, were the most piv pivotal moments of my life. I'm grateful that I had the opportunity to learn, transform, and continue doing what I love. Our generation will be, will be marked by its ability to hold others accountable, but reformation will not work when we, as a society, refuse to accept a genuine change. For those who've had a moral lapse, trust the journey that is progression. And for those upholding accountability, when the time is right, allow yourselves to forgive. Otherwise, I believe our denial of individual growth rejects one of the most important values that make us human. And I think that value is acceptance. If you are so shut off to the idea of someone being able to improve and change, what are we doing here? Yeah. It's making mistakes is so, it's such a, it's such a human it's so it's so human of us. Like it, no one, no one walking around on this planet is perfect. Granted, there are <laughs> levels to this shit, but I think if you're completely shut off to the idea of giving people an opportunity to take responsibility for their actions, learn from them, and continue progressing, you've immediately lost. And that's all I was trying to stay, say here. I don't, I don't want to speak on this um, too, too much because it, 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 it isn't my deal. I just hope everyone um, involved it, it does realize the gravity of the situation and um, is like I uh, consider myself to be back then, enthusiastic and willing to both learn and progress from the situation. I think otherwise you're going to lose right off the bat. And for everyone watching on the wayside, like sure, take your digs now, make your assumptions and assessments, but... Um, allow yourselves to forgive when the time is right. That's all. That's all I ask, and that's all I'll say. It's a very dangerous line that that some of us walk between real life and entertainment. And 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 so David is currently burning as a result of things he said that he may have been saying to be applicable to content he thought he was creating as entertainment, which are now becoming applicable to real life wrongs. I.e. the we're all going to jail joke that he made at the end of the fucking vlog episode. Was that, was that, a who knows video? dog? Who, I mean, what I'm saying is this, like, who knows? Like that's a joke that any one of us would have made. Yeah. I've made, uh, but we're I've all going to jail. Yeah, yeah, everybody said Everybody, that. if you're walking that line. Yeah. And so, so this is a very, and, and, and this is not me justifying, this is, a, this is not me saying anything a, a, around who's wrong, who, whatever. All I'm saying is the ability to look back, they say hindsight 2020, to look back and make everything applicable to one real life wrong it gets real easy to make somebody look like a piece of fucking dog shit, dude. When you go back and pick apart content yeah, after somebody makes a mistake, <laughs> man. And so it seems like that's what's happening now. And you've seen, and you got this pile on dude. And it's sad, bro. Listen, it's sad to see. It really is. It's sad to see if you're, if you're a person out there and you're watching this episode or you're making TikToks, and you're rooting on someone's downfall and you're sitting there and, I mean, that's a sad fucking existence, dog. That's a sad fucking existence. I don't, and I don't mean looking, I don't, I don't mean. I have to, I, I have to. Let me, no, let me, let me, let me say no, this. No, no. So, I no. mean, I mean really rooting 
Like, yo, that's the most successful person. I don't like the fact that that person's yeah, successful, bro, dude. Bro, when you're talking about a hard R rate. Oh, hold on a second. No, no, no. Like I said. You, then what are you nah, talking about? Because it's, I, I, it's it, like, it is sad to see until you consider the circumstance and you oh, go. Oh, no. Oh. Yeah, yeah. no, 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 oh, no, no. Every I, ounce of sadness that I had is allocated to the victim. No, 100%. So, so I, I hear you, right? Because also, I it, I I agree. It, it sucks. It fucking sucks. But there's a very specific thing here where, where my sadness hits a fucking peak. A hundred percent. Dom, Dom or, you know, just. Can, can I say just, Dom needs to be Dom needs to be held accountable. There's yeah. no question about it. You know what I'm saying? D like if 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 it's found that David, you know, facilitated in some way, he needs to be held accountable. There's no question about that. Yo, Listen, when I said let that, me, let that say clip this. that went viral. Of me. Which one? Which one? Uh, basically telling David like. Oh, oh yeah, yeah. yeah. I didn't just like say that because I was, I felt some type of way. Like I really meant that. Yeah, for sure. You know, that wasn't like a, a, a guess, man. No, no, I know. But he was, was he just was a Simpsons acting, episode. But he was acting. <laughs> that was who we were. You were the Sips. But he was acting. Bro, David was exhibiting a lot of signs of that, of that, um better than thou attitude that you, that you called him out on. And so I'm not even talking about that, but I just mean, if we, if we start to be extremely cautious of how we act and what we say simply because someone may be offended by what we do or say behind closed doors, it, it's just, I, I still believe it to be a very slippery slope. And I think if David looked in the mirror right now, he, he knows now. He knows now he's got changes to make. Right? Well, he he knows now, he has changes to make. I also realized this in hindsight because I spoke to someone who, who I kind of had a back and forth with when I was um, going through my tumultuous times. Uh, true change takes a while. Oh, yeah. It, it, like, you might know right off the bat, like, I, I need something needs to change, but it took me three years. I'm, st I'm, I'm still like learn. Like, I don't, I wouldn't say I'm like out of the woods just yet, but I'm still like learning from that whole experience. Like it takes out of the woods. Oh, what? <laughs> oh. <laughs> Damn man. Get the fuck out of there. <laughs> you gotta get out of there. Get out. You need to leave. <laughs> leave those true, true, true change. You know, on, on a character level. Where you gotta alter the way you think. Atomic. It's like some. Atomic, it's it's atom hard. It's 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 hard. That's why Go, Goku autonomous. That's why these apology videos. I mean, like, why do apologies come in twos? I I even had a, an apology that came in twos. First one I was written by me, and I was like, and I had no fucking idea. Like there was zero accountability taken. I had no. I couldn't comprehend it because it doesn't happen overnight. Like true change takes a fucking minute, and uh, I think I think. In order for uh, that to happen, we're gonna need to we're gonna need to patiently wait and watch uh, over the next couple of years. But I mean, I, what's I, it, what's net? Like, what? well, I believe David will make it out of it. I, like I, I said this when Shane Dawson had his thing. Like, they ain't no coming back. You done? It's over. David will David will come back. He'll, he'll be but back. what is? But what he's got to he's got to get the content, he's got to learn, content look like? improve, and 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 get extremely extremely creative with what he's making because I believe any sort of a vlog squad based group camaraderie content in the style that is David Dober vlogs will come with a little bit of a bad taste from people Bro, are watching because they Dude, I was blessed. Shout out KSI, like for real. And, and I'm so thankful that, that I had the opportunity to fight Literally, fight my way back up. Literally, dude, I'm 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 fighting to try to change me and try to uh, earn a a spot back in what I like. I wanted to be back with my peers in a respectable way, and I did so through boxing. And it was like a nice career pivot that really helped me find out who I was and become a person I really loved.